Hello everybody, welcome to Geeky Give Up. Today I'm going to be reacting to the trailer for the TV adaptation of Stephen King's Eight from 1990. Let's do this. God, is it going to be since his first in years? <laughs> Why are you guys anywhere? We're sort of a club. Yeah. Yeah, the losers club. I should have joined them. You want in? So now we could. Yeah, I do. Good. Okay, we're seven now. Lucky seven. Yeah. That's all lucky. I want to kill it. Hmm. I just want to forget about it. Oh. It's not just us. It's all the other kids, too. Oh, they like Who's going to be next? Chunky? It kills kids, damn it. You killed my brother George, you bastard. Does it get into nobody's years later, though? Let's see you now. Maybe it's the water. The water? Maybe it's the sewer. Yeah. Oh. Georgie. Oh. <laughs> I think Kerr was awesome in this part. It wasn't. Yeah. Was it Pennywise? Uh, uh. Big white guy, red nose. <laughs> about 75 feet tall, mouth full of razor sharp teeth. Yeah, that's it. Smell that? Oh shit. That's death. Oh, the contents of weapons. Losers fight it. Losers die. That's what you could tell, huh? <laughs> okay, hope you enjoyed that. I know I did. That just reminded me how creepy Tim Curry was at playing the part. I thought it was horrible enough when he was in the Rocky Horror Show. <laughs> but in that, it was what I found scary about the original Pennywise was that he seemed, in some respects, he was psychier, he was funnier. He was more, in some respects, because he seemed more human. He was creepier. That's the thing that worked good. They got it wrong with the new one. Make him too much like a monster. That's what people don't like about clowns is that they seem human, but they're not quite human, even though they act that way. Um, but it's for me anyway. But I enjoyed that. We're back to when I was a kid. Anyway, this has been Geek Gibber. Hope you enjoyed my reaction. I'll see you next time. Have a good day. Goodbye. The tea. The TV adaptation of Stephen King's